Thank you. Uh, Godfrey Bloom. Uh, thank you, uh, Mr. President. Uh, it seems that many members of the Commission, and uh, indeed my committee, uh, and the Parliament blame credit rating agencies uh, and currency dealers for the demise of certain sovereign debt. And I'd like to ask you, and I find that a little bit difficult to cope with personally, but I'd, I'd be very much interested in your view, and if I may ask you perhaps a slightly light-hearted question, but I'd be interested to see your response, because we're dealing with a principle here. If you went to a race meeting, if you went to your famous Arc de Triomphe, and if you backed a three-legged horse, let's call it junk debt, and it came last... Would you blame yourself for backing it? Would you blame the horse? Would you blame the jockey? Or would you blame the bookmakers? Uh, as uh, I have to confess, I don't bet on uh, <laughs> such horse races. And I'm not uh, very, very keen on hang, uh, going to the Arc de Triomphe uh, or to any other uh, horse race. Um, and I will not comment any more but saying what we are expecting from, I would say, not only rating agencies, but uh, all the uh, part and parcel of global finance after the experiences of the last year, and particularly, of course, after what we have seen in 07, 08, 09, and now, is that we would have the least possible part and parcel of global finance that would be pro-cyclical. So that would amplify the fluctuations that we are observing in global finance, the booms and the busts, and uh, on the contrary, if I may, would uh, have a tendency to play in the direction of as much as possible financial stability. And it is not necessarily the case when you see the functioning. And I'm not blaming anybody. I'm on, only making uh, an observation which I trust corresponds to what we are all looking for, namely more stability at uh, the level of global finance. So it's uh, not challengeable, it seems to me, that some elements are playing in the direction of instability and that's, that is not very good. But that doesn't mean that it is easy to solve. After all, the G20 is reflecting on such issues since uh, the very beginning of the intensification of the crisis. And again, it is true for rating agencies' behavior. It is true for a number of other factors that uh, are deemed to not to incorporate all the elements that uh, would permit to be less pro-cyclical and more prone to help us in ensuring financial stability. Thank you.